Corpus Christi first responders underwent intense training today to help prepare for emergency situations before they happen. Our Michael Gibson caught up with them today and has this report. Firefighter Craig Stokes is one of two members of a rescue team being lowered down into this hatch of this barge. This firefighting rescue training exercise was taking place at Kirby Inland Marine along the ship channel at the port. If you haven't trained on it, you do not want to go down there, especially in that, in that uh, scenario because very likely you may not make it out of there and you're going to be more of a hindrance. This rescue effort took an entire team of firefighters. First, they had to bring a whole lot of equipment on board, then had to put up this tripod. It's used to lower and raise the firefighters along with their victim on this day. That injured party happened to be a dummy and it had at least a broken leg. It was just a few years ago that Corpus Christi firefighters had to put some of this training into action as a huge barge fire erupted here in the port. It was back on August 21st of 2020 when a barge exploded along the port. It killed five people and sent a number of workers to the hospital. Battalion Chief Michael Schmidt worked that rescue effort. In the port, we had the fire on, on one of the ships many years ago. Uh, I was in on that as well. So you just don't know. We don't, this isn't something we do on a daily basis, obviously. This may be a one in a year type of scenario, but if we don't play and practice for the real thing, then when the real thing happens, then it can be a real danger to us and, and the victims. Firefighter Stokes and the chiefs in charge of this operation believe this rescue effort was a big success. From beginning to end, it took less than 30 minutes to get down to that victim and get them bundled up and lifted up onto the deck. Stokes told 3 News that you can't exactly train for every scenario, but exercises like these are invaluable to the men and women whose job it is to rescue those in dire need of help. Michael Gibson, 3 News. Wow, what a training.